My name is Marilyn Monroe, and my birth name is Marcella Breck. I am a musical theater actor and na uh, nanny by night, mostly. Oh. Marilyn Monroe. Marilyn Monroe, oh, whoa, Marilyn Monroe. <laughs> Um, definitely came alive when uh, I was definitely experimenting with my self-identity um, and the fact, you know, I was a musical theater kid. It helped to let me escape my day-to-day -day problems, you know, with a homophobic family and transphobic family that is deeply religious from a very closeted community. I was able to find a connection between, like, the super feminine and still being an actor at the same time. Once I moved to New York City and became that working actor, I knew I definitely needed more of a feminine escape. So that's when drag came into the forefront of my life. Marilyn Monroe was created, born, and hasn't left yet. And she's not paying rent, so that's a problem. Drag has helped my self-confidence, my body image, and just all around self-love. Drag is all about creating this community and this space of love and acceptance. Marilyn and Marcel are essentially the same person now. I know that I can't be Marcel without Marilyn. I call her my Wonder Woman. She is the physical embodiment of like strength and perseverance and like constantly just showing love to any and everybody that she needs. Spread as much love in this world as you can. We're at a time in our lives where we are constantly pitted against each other, and if we're constantly doing that, we're gonna constantly tear each other down as women, as men, as cisgender people, as non-binary people, as transgender people, and we don't need that. At the end of the day, we're human, and we deserve to be treated like humans. We need to kind of like stand together regardless of our, our biases. Just love each other, because without love, like, you're not getting laid.